British Gas has advised its customers to check which appliances are on standby and using electricity, including game consoles, laptops, TVs, and set-top boxes, to save on the company's escalating energy bills. The warning that these so-called vampire devices are using electricity expensive for you, but unnecessary for the planet, comes as the UK faces an unprecedented surge in energy prices while gas and electricity companies continue to earn take huge profits. Indeed, the language used by British Gas in today's appeal has been criticised for shifting the responsibility for the high bills onto consumers. Questions were also asked about the numbers British Gas used to calculate its savings. British Gas's own research, published by BBC News, appears to suggest that an average of £147 a year could be saved by switching off vampire devices. This breaks down to £24.61 a year to keep your TV on standby, £12.17 for a game console and £11.22 for a computer. Speaking to the BBC, British gas energy expert Mark Robson recommends buying smart sockets and turning off appliances on the grid. The article elicited a number of responses that questioned the numbers, especially those related to the cost of keeping the TV on standby. This is actually an incorrect and outrageous alarmist by BG, one of the responses read. Since 2013, the law has required TVs to consume 0.5 watts power or less in standby mode. That's 4.38 kilowatts per year. At 30p kilowatt, it costs £1.31 per year. Says it costs £24.61 it's a lie. It's have you tried wearing just one sweater? but in the warmer months, added absolute radio host Ross Buchanan. It is very offensive to place the onus on consumers, rather than governments or energy companies, for increasing bills, whether or not your study is accurate. Previous reports of vampire devices costing UK billpayers big bucks have shown that oft-quoted figures, such as those based on TV standby use, are based on outdated measurements and equipment and are unrealistic in practice. Earlier this year, Xbox announced that it had quietly switched its consoles to the default power saving mode, which now also checks for and downloads updates when not in use. Microsoft encourages everyone to remain in their in.